maybe because I'm an inherently angry animal. I'm a mantis shrimp. <laughs> but you're all intelligent people, so we can use my scientific name, stomatopod. Rolls off the tongue better, stomatopod. Say it with me, stomatopod. I have this huge pair of specialized appendages for spearing or smashing apart just about anything I find on the bottom of the ocean. Is this food? Whack it! Is this my enemy? Whack it! Is that guy trying to have sex with me? Whack it! Each whack of my hammer packs a lot of punch, 1,500 newtons of force to be exact, which is a thousand times or more of my body weight. I can do this because my arm is spring-loaded, just like a crossbow. I slowly contract a muscle before pulling a latch right here, ding, to release my hammer, shoo, with speeds up to 83 miles per hour. That's, if I were on the motorway, I'd get a speeding ticket. <laughs> but I'm underwater so the coppers can't catch me. My hammer moves so fast through the water that molecules don't have, the water molecules don't have time to, to fill in the space. And so an area of low pressure forms and a cavitation bubble results. This bubble collapses a half a millisecond after impact, producing a second force, half that of the first, plus heat, sound, and light. <laughs> it's just like Harry Potter's defense spell. Expel all this! Except I don't need a magical wand. Just physics. <laughs> but there's more to my anger. And it's not just scientists who poke me with sticks or living with sand in places not polite to talk about or Donald Trump. <laughs> I'm angry because my home, my beautiful, life-giving home, the coral reef, is dying. Forget about the thousands of species of fish and other neighbors I have. Coral reefs are home to the greatest number of stomatopod species on the planet. Just in, around one island in the Great Barrier Reef, there's more than 32 different species of my fellow stomatopod. Global climate change is causing sea temperatures to rise and corals to bleach, which is when their food-producing algae leave and the corals starve and die without the corals me and my neighbors don't have a home, don't have food, and soon enough, we're not going to have anyone to have sex with. And it's all because of you, intelligent human beings with your modern way of life, your fossil fuels, carbon emissions. That's why I'm angry. And I hope you're angry too. Now please help fix it. Vamos, Dr. Fellas!